Okay, so on Trader View, there's actually a really cool feature um, that will enable you to uh, plan your position and see how much your potential profit's going to be and whatnot before you put the trade on. Okay, so it enables you to strategize your uh, trade, okay, plan it completely. Okay, where's your 2% risk going to go? Because we say not to use more than 2% risk. Uh, where's your take profit going to be and what is the potential of that trade? And you can do that using the um, long position and short position tools. Okay, and a lot of people use these without actually knowing the feature that's within them. Okay, so I've got them on my bookmark bar here because I use them all the time. But they're in the one, two, three, four, five, six, seventh tab down on the left on the tool toolbar. Okay, if you go in there, you'll see long and short position. And if I take the short position one, and for instance, if this candle closed in on this uh, bearish shooting star, okay, if I wanted to enter there, okay, I'll just click on it. Now, the interface of this is, uh, you know, very easy to use, okay, but you don't get to full functionality unless you double click it. You don't really need to, okay, you can drag your stop loss position, okay, uh, to, all right, 78 pips, take profit is 241 pips, yeah, risk to reward ratio is free, okay, so it's giving you all the important information, yeah, it's all giving you all the pertinent information to tell you, you know, uh, it's a good quality setup with regards to risk management. Okay, but what if you want to know how it would affect your actual balance? Okay, and how can you plan that risk into your stop loss? And the way to do that is to just double click it. Okay, and you know you don't really need to go on style, but what it does have, it does give you um, the option to add your account size and add your risk. And I, I don't think um, I think this is just a general tool across all pairs. Okay, to give you a generalized you know, pip value. I'm not sure whether this it's uh, a pip value that's actually relevant to the pair. There's obviously all pip pairs uh, have different value pips. Okay, not that much difference, but there's still different values. So if my account size was seven thousand and I risked two percent, okay, that two percent is between my entry point and my stop loss. So I can drag my stop loss anywhere I want, but my risk will still be two percent. Okay, and what it'll do is it'll tell you the profit and loss margins on each side with regard to having a seven thousand account. Okay, so just to make that easier, let me change that to 1,000, okay, and you see see how it works. All right, 1,000, 2% risk. So you can see if my stop loss was in that current position, it'd be on 980. If if you know uh, my target was hit, I'd have 1,060. So you can see I'd be losing 20 pound, okay, to potentially gain 60. Yeah, so that's how you trade. All right, There's some decent uh, risk reward setups there. Okay, but the, it also has more functionality in, than that. You can drag this, okay, within, when you're in the trade, drag this however much you want to see what your current value is, what your current risk to reward ratio is. So if there was a candle down uh, down here, okay, I say, right, what's what's the status of that with regards to equity? Um, you know, how much profit has it made? It's, it's made just over, you know, uh, one risk to reward ratio, which isn't great, okay. But if the markets change, then you can take profit out and know you've got just over one percent. Um, account balance one thousand twenty three, okay, great. Yeah, but you know, if you've entered a position on MetaTrader, okay, you can double click this, go to coordinates, yeah, and actually set in the exact prices you put in uh, MetaTrader or you know whatever platform you use. So obviously okay i'm using an fxcm chart here uh, whoever your broker is the prices will be slightly different uh the way you got in okay because you know bro brokers generally move the same way uh, but the actual prices can vary a little bit okay so you can uh measure how many pips to your stop loss okay you want yeah or you can put the price in that your stop loss is in on metatrader okay so for instance if i if my price my stop loss is at 144 i just change that to 144 okay and then update that uh, your actual precise entry price without having to try and uh, move the slider okay and your actual take profit level so if my uh take profit was let's say 140.8 okay it's just moved the green box slightly and that's all there is to it okay it's, it's very very easy to use and not many people actually know about this functionality. So I've got, there's everything now on this little tool, you know, that I need when I'm in this trade. Okay, I don't really need to go to MetaTrader. I can already see exactly uh, the status of my of my trade. And it actually helps if you don't go to, to MetaTrader or whatnot, because then you might decide to take money out early. Yeah, or get emotional when actually you should be believing in the trade. 
so you can lock this as well. Okay, if you right click on it and press lock, okay, it's now locked in position. Yeah, so you can't move that now. That's that's there. So you can't move it by accident. Uh, and obviously to unlock it, you just right click unlock. So it's a really useful feature um, that a lot of people don't know about. And so one of my members was asking about it. So I thought I'd come on here and explain a little bit about it. Uh, have a play around. Okay, very, very useful thing. All right, cheers.